One week from tonight, the Big East Tournament is in New York, but a big one coming up from the Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey tonight. NCAA Tournament implications in this one. It's UConn and Seton Hall. Whaley and Sonogo both good inside. You saw Seton Hall's group, another veteran unit for Kevin Willard, whose team badly needs it tonight. Points, but they shot 50% from the field, also 50% from behind the arc. Games, um, their net rating is 39, so they're sitting in pretty good position. You come on the road here. Saw against Georgetown, and we saw at Butler in their last game when they had a season low 52. So no go over the top, gets it to roll home. It's really just bouncing, exploded offensively. Marquette's first three is short. Rebound, Sonogo had it taken away, then got it back and finished. Sonogo with a couple of buckets for the Huskies. That jumper's blocked by Sonogo, doing some good things over the first few minutes. James McNutt, 20 points per game, still looking for his first points of this one. Sonogo goes to work, and six early ones for the freshman. Mill from Roden, couldn't bank it in. Here comes Booknight for UConn. Stop and start and slam. James Booknight's first points of the night. Christmas. Yeah, yeah, you know, but you know, those are good shots. You're open. You gotta trust that you can knock him in as certainly as teammates do. Whaley works hard, got the defender off his feet. Booknight goes baseline. Somehow he caught it with two taller players right there. Freshman for UConn is in for the first time. 44 for the Huskies coming off his best game. He's got it here with two on the shot clock. Gives it up for Whaley, who cans a three. Then you get into the tournament, make a run. You, you set yourself up pretty good to just if you can win the tournament. The teaser. On a spoil. UConn one of ten. Offensively in this latest stretch as R.J. Cole snaps that skid, nailing a three for it to call Molson, who couldn't hit it. Booknight lines it up and hits it. There you go. In transition, he pulls up and hits the three. Not take advantage of it. Final seconds of this first half. James Booknight has his shot blocked. Whaley's there to follow and give UConn its first lead of the game as the first half horn sounds. Away. James Booknight short with a three. Whaley over the top for the rebound. Second chance opportunity for the Huskies. Booknight takes advantage. 20 per game for Booknight. Well, you will see him at the top of the scouting report. I guarantee you that. <laughs> Every Booknight night. Loses the handle. Back comes Martin, pushing for the Huskies. Tyrese Martin, tip, follow, no. Third try, yes, for Whaley. Particular at home and on senior night. Book night, good handles to get inside. Wanted to foul, won't get it. Sonogo is there to clean it up and extend the run. Times, they get so stagnant in their half-court sets that they're stymied and can't put the ball in the basket. Sonogo high off the glass and a dozen for him. He's not going to be denied that time. Wheeled his way to the rim. Worked his way into double figures. 37-30. Cole probing for space. He hits the jumper from the free throw line. Jackson pushes. Really thought about it. Now I'll step inside the arc and drain the mid-range shot. Go and win the pull back that time. Five seconds left, not a good time to foul. Cole with a step back. Knocks down the three. Cole wants it cleared out. He's feeling it now. Working against Molson. RJ Cole backs it up way outside. Gets a better look. The runner goes for Cole. No pressure in the backcourt. Jackson finds Whaley and a goal 10. You got to get ahead of it, but you want him to be able to get warm and have some rhythm and not bring him in too late. So, but Coach, Coach Hurley has a feel for Book Knight and him playing with three fouls, obviously. Sonogo with a sweeping runner, and he's got a new career high 14. Here looks to push. Abu Kelishvili with a head of steam, lost the handle. Book Knight looks to counter, shares with Gaffney, who throws it down. Jalen Gaffney, his first points of the night looked like that. Gaffney's done. Well, Joe, you said you didn't know that Jalen Gaffney had these kind, this kind of bop in his game. He said, man, just Google me. You'll figure it out. The new Big East. Seton Hall's got to put its foot down soon. Trailing by 11, the game it needs. Cole rattles in another. 
Some pressure out of the inbounds. They nearly came up with a steal. Instead, Cole breaks it. Three on one. Whaley takes advantage. Booknight working against Molson. Leans into it. Long rebound. Loose ball falls right to Whaley. And maybe it's just UConn's night. That does it. 69-58, the final score. UConn is now 13-6 and 10-6 in the Big East.